Alright, this is a sound test. We are roughly two and a half feet away from the uh, microphone and this is what we are doing. You can see we are set in high stereo is the mode that we are in, shooting at 4K, 30fps. All uh, Everything else just set to uh, factory settings, um, just how it comes out of the box. So that's our first clip. Okay, so now we are doing this mode. Uh, we have microphone in high, <clears throat> sound effect on wind mode to compensate for the wind buffeting of, of wind noise, the you know, stupid sound that is going to happen no matter what. Um, but this is supposed to compensate a little bit for it. So next up we're going to try one of the lower mic settings. Alright, so for our next mic test, uh, we are set on uh, microphone low, uh, and we are on sound effect stereo as of right now, and here's the firmware and everything that we're running. Okay. And again, we're still roughly uh, two, two and a half feet from the camera. Alright, now we're going to try the next one. Okay, now we're running in microphone low setting with the sound effect in wind mode. Mic low, wind, effect. Mic low, sound effect, wind. Um, and we're just going to see what the best settings are for all of this stuff. This is all shot in 4K, 30 frames. Um, latest, as of now, latest firmware version 1.4.14 for the E4K. Um, Now, I, I haven't gone through and listened to all the footage yet, but kind of thinking out loud and going by what I think should be the, the best one, I'm going to stick with microphone in the high setting uh, to make sure it picks up on everything and leave it in the, the, the wind effect mode because I, I don't really... I've used the stereo mode at, you know, in previous firmware versions. It hasn't really... It doesn't really expand the aural spatialness. Is that a word? It's not like in my other like Sony action cams, which have a great you know stereo microphone, which really opens up the sound of the uh, environment that you're in. And this one here just seems like it's two mono mics that are aimed the same, and they're very close together, so you don't really get that that spatial environment. But anyways, I, I think I'll be, I'm just going to leave it on the uh, uh, on the wind mode, um, and it'll should be able to pick up fine and then maybe even buffet some of that wind noise that usually comes in. But also keep in mind this is before I've reviewed any of this footage so that that may change. If it does I'll come back with another one to explain my findings. Till the next time uh, we'll see it. Alright, thanks. Bye.